our town looks wonderful. I mean, look at that. It does actually. This is the nice bit. Hey guys, it's another bright and beautiful day in Bolton, so I thought I'd have a wander around town and show you some of the nice architecture in here. I mean, look at this place. It's beautiful. So, it's lovely to see that in bright light, everything looks wonderful. And uh, basically, I've come out of the house because I needed a uh, break from work. Worked late last night getting the comic done. I'm going to go home and get some uh, work for the council done and then some more comics. So, busy day. Let's go. Another bit of Bolton's history here, Stone Dry Weatherwear. Now that's an old one. Apparently a Gen, this is the same shop here. That was uh, previously a WH Smith Harding. And after that, uh, recently was uh, Pam Bakery or something like that. And then they've taken the hoardings off because they're redoing the changes on Newport Street. We found W Smith, the old 60s style one, taking that off. And now that's underneath. So that's quite an interesting change. It's quite interesting to see all this stuff start to turn up again. And what you're actually seeing here is probably just the shadow where previously there's been raised metal letters screwed over the top. But actually, all that's left now is really just the dirt that accumulated around them before they've been removed. But it does mean that we can read what the shop used to be. And my guess is probably 60s, maybe 70s um, was when that shop was that. But we'll find out. We'll ask the internet and somebody will know. Fantastic. There we are. Another infinity figure for the collection. Crystal ones. I thought we had them all when I was uh, doing the collection and I remembered the, cl the crystal ones afterward. And they do count as different characters on plinths in the game, so I'm picking them up as I go along. But it's nice to see that they're still around. Finding Series 1 of Disney Infinity in its box is an amazing thing these days. They're turning up in remanded stores like The Works and uh, Poundland and things like that. So I'm looking around everywhere I go just to see if we've got them. Because there are seven crystal ones. Now I thought that they just counted as separate versions of the main characters. And when you put them on it uh, turned up on the same plinth. But it turns out that's not true. There's a section of uh, the Hall of Heroes for the Infinity characters that is separate just for the crystal versions of characters. So naturally I have to have them all to finish the collection because now they count as something else. So I'm doing that but I'm going to leave these ones in the boxes as like display pieces. I've got over there all of the uh, normal Infinity characters so now I'm putting as a little display thing all the ones in the boxes. It's going to be nice and it's going to work as part of the museum once it's ready which I keep talking about. It's still a long time off, like years off but we'll get there in the end. Anyway, I better get back to work. See you later. Oh, and if you're wondering, yeah, that mark on my face is a cold sore. Change of weather, and I've been run down because of a huge amount of work to do. So I got a cold sore. It, it happens. And uh, I'll tell you now, if you don't get them, then you're the weird one, because 90% of people in the world have cold sores. So if you don't get them, you're the weird one. Haha. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm back home now, and uh, I'm trying my best to eat better, eat right, uh, eat healthy. So I've come in, and uh, basically I've got some stuff that's in the freezer. Jen picks it up from uh, Costco, I think it is. And it's called yakisoba. It's uh, like a Japanese ready meal. You defrost it in the microwave and eat it. It's... Uh, Pretty simple. So I'm going to have that and then I'm going to get to work. I've got a lot of emails I have to catch up on because I, over the weekend I couldn't get onto my emails because uh, I had to change my password at the time. It's a regular thing, you have to update your passwords and it locks you out if you don't. And I didn't have a chance to go and update it uh, during the week because of work because I had a lot to do and uh, as a result couldn't do any emails over the weekend so now I've got like 30 or 40 emails to catch up on but I can do that. I've got time today because I knew it was going to happen and uh, left time so Yay. Okay, since it's a nice day, I'm going to do my council work via email in here. I thought, why not?
Oh, it feels good to be making comics again. Now, today's all of the house uh, I did yesterday. I just finished making tomorrow's, and it took almost two hours. It should take me about an hour and a half, so I'm getting better and getting back up to speed, but it's still not right for it. So it's going to take a bit more practice to get back into shape for making comics, but I'm feeling good about it. I wanted to make a Nog Mouse one today as well. Haven't had time because it's now quarter to one in the morning. I've got to get this vlog finished so I can get up early because I have a lot of work to do tomorrow and I just can't miss it. So I've got to do that. So it's going to be busy, but I've got to get this done. So let's get on with it. Anyway, I'm going to cut it now because I need to make the vlog. <laughs> so I'll see you tomorrow and I hope you had a good time. start to record very loud vehicles pass. It's like magic, you can just conjure them. Yeah. Hey guys. The world hates you. <laughs> the world does hate me.